Hello everyone, this is Nathan from MadCats. As any Android Power user will tell you, the best way to get the most out of your device is to root it, and Mojo is no different. Our friends at Marco have created a mod that applies root and grants expanded access to games and apps available within the Google Play Store on Mojo. If you go to their website, it gives brief instructions on how to get the root applied. What you'll need is a Mojo, a USB mail-to-mail cable, and a computer. It's important to note that you get a regular USB mail-to-mail cable, not a transfer cable, otherwise it won't work. If you scroll down, you'll see a download link for the file you need. Depending on the operating system you're running, instructions will slightly vary. What we will be doing here is a quick run through of how to install the Monaco mod using a Windows 7 PC. Let's take a look at the Google Play Store on Mojo. Click on Games and then note the initial games offering. Let's check for games such as Sonic 4. Unfortunately, Sonic 4 doesn't show up, so let's apply the mod. Now when you download the file, we suggest unzipping it to the root directory of your PC, in this case the C drive. This will make the rest easier to explain. Unplug the Mojo, but go ahead and leave the HDMI plugged in. Here's the mail-to-mail -mail USB cable. Plug one end into your PC, and the other end to the USB 2.0 port on your Mojo. Now plug in the power. If this is the first time you've connected the Mojo to your PC, notification should pop up and auto-install drivers. On the HDMI screen, it should show up as Key Driver Not Found Booting OS. If you don't get notifications, you can check your device and printers to see if a fast boot device is connected. You can right click Properties, click on the Hardware tab, and you should see ADB interface from MadCats. Regardless of whether the drivers were installed automatically or manual, we suggest to unplug the USB and power from the Mojo to reset the device. This ensures no issues when you run the actual batch file. Plug the USB back in first and then the power. Now open the start menu and type cmd to open up the command prompt terminal. From here, type cd dot dot to change the, di the directory back to the root directory. Type cd r3 mojo superboot mmm to get to the correct directory. Then type superboot windows to run the batch file. On the HDMI screen, booting downloaded image should show up. The screen should then go blank and then come back again. Unplug both the USB and power from Mojo, and then just plug in the power by itself to boot Mojo as normal. A notification should show up saying Android is upgrading. Now let's check the Google Play Store. Click on Games. If the initial games offering looks the same as before, you may need to go to your settings to clear the Google Play Store's data. Go to Settings. Scroll down to Apps. Click on Google Play Store. Clear data. And then OK to confirm. Now unplug and replug again to reboot the system. Check the Google Play Store and click on Games. The initial games offering should now be slightly different. Try searching for Sonic 4 again. Sonic 4 should now show up, along with other games and apps that may not have been available before. And that's how you apply the root with Windows 7 PC. Thank you for watching, everyone.